Ooh. I have a baby kitty. What happened? I was three in 1988. Okay, that looks fine. Everything's Hello? fine. Okay, we're all good. We're definitely in the Mr. same Mucci? place. Did something go wrong? Interesting. I betcha. I betcha I'm now like living this inside of a, a computer simulation that we're bombarding, bombarding my brain with stimuli. But like, running into that. I, I'm not supposed to put myself in. This is kind of stressing me out. Yeah, it's kind of stressing me out too. Damn, what? I'm gonna go over hey. here. Yeah, Anyone? let's uh, turn that on. Oh shit! What? 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 What is this place? How did I get here? What? It's a completely different place. Let's figure this out. I just need to stay calm. No need to make things worse. Okay. All right. Unlock terminal from service console. Okay, I got this. Service console, it's right over there, okay. All right, it's okay, Simon, we're gonna be okay. I wanna put on one of these suits just to like wear it. I'm so irreverent to games. Omni-tool chip installer. Build, shape, and optimize your Omni-tool with fully customized tools and assistance. Is that the sort of thing that I have? Nearby toolbox. Toolbox. Okay, cool. Yep, good. Right, service console. Insert Omni tool to access. Okay, need to find an Omni tool. Where's the Omni tool? Oh God, there's blood on the floor. There's what? There's blood from the chair to that vent. Is that a leg? No. It's just some stuff. It could have been a leg. Uh huh. Okay. Yep. No Omni tool here. Is that an Omni tool? Hello? Are you an Omni tool? No. Yeah, mm-hmm. Okay, so probably out the door. Probably not out the door. Yeah, gonna have to like open that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, interesting. Uh, I think that Frictional does really good transitions. Like just this there was this weird thing where, like, I guess it was this that I had to pull on in order to to turn on the lights, and then I was already looking out this weird window because it was right in my frame of view. That was great, great transition. Omni Tool Chip Installer. Okay, so we do in fact need an Omni Tool. Are these lockers? No, no, those are just hooks to hang things on. Oh. Huh. Well. Well then. Yeah, that hint was, like, perfect. Perfect hint. Okay, cool. We good, boys. Uh-huh. Like... Can you imagine if this actually happened to you? You would be really freaked out. You would be really freaked out if this actually happened to you. Now I can't quite tell if it's just... Like, what if I go down a little bit? I can't tell if it's just the walking animation or if it's like it just feels a little bit too slow for me. 
Wow, those lower quality textures are way lower quality. I don't think I want to... Oh, there we go. Now they're loading in. Yeah, that's better. Like, I think, I think the walking animation is just a little bit jerky. Do you guys feel that? Like, I kind of jerk just a little bit as I'm moving forwards. Eh, maybe it's a little better now. That's good. All right, whatever. Uh, Terakai is making a really good point. Everything here looks futuristic or in some way like highly technological, but the do not enter sign is a is a sufficiently grounded element that tells you you're still dealing with human things, which is absolutely true and excellent point. Good good noticing Terakai. Break room data buffer available. Whoa! Oh my God! It's working better than expected. They're having a really hard time getting the doors open. Call Permis Hill as many as you can. Rather not take any chances. Roger. Did you cut off the factory floor? All done. Should keep most of them out. I'm on my way to lock off the comm center. Oh. Just make sure to leave a way out of here. Trust me, I'll get you to data safe and sound. We just need to make sure we're leaving our power running so we don't have to return. I hear that. See you back at camp. Huh. How did I do that? I don't know, but like there's some sort of like fingers disintegrating icon. That's kind of cool. I like that. That's cool. Kind of implies I just like stuck my fingers in there. Do do. Ooh. Yep. No mirror. Mirror is broken. Telling. But uh, get wrecked, soap. Oh, yeah, no, this looks perfectly safe. Okay, hey, let's just, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I gotta close that door, get a little privacy. Okay, I get it. Uh, mm. All right, I feel like anybody could just come in here. Mm. All right, good. Uh, yep. Uh, we'll just, yep. Yeah. Uh -huh. Don't need to leave that up. Uh, okay, good. Cool. Uh, didn't see a flush, so guess I'm not flushing. Hide in it? No. There's something spoopy. What on earth? Like, seriously, what on earth is that? What is that even? Uh, time for a shower. I'm very irreverent towards games. I like it. I don't know what it is, but I like it. I don't know what that is. It's like something growing out of the the tech stuff. It's like growing biotech stuff. I like it. I didn't wash my hands. Mmm. Spinach. Rice, curry mix, ooh, munch print. Let's do some rice, some curry mix. Oh, go on, go, go in the thing. Oh, I wanna print some munch. And it's not even powered on, disappointing. Okay, so there's really nothing in there. flashlight or anything. Very sad. K-cup. Coffee machine. Water bottle. Get wrecked, water bottle. Mm. Uh, Flipomaniacs is asking if I'll host the H1Z1 thing. Answer, yes. Yes, I will. Yeah, looks like it's got about half an hour to go before that fires up. Pancake Flipper loves the way I interact with everything and wants me to play a game like this all the way through. We'll see, Pancake Flipper. I'm loving it so far. I just love frictional game stuff. I think they're so good. Good at what they do. Okay, so here's like another lock. Oh, shit. I broke the pneumatic seal. 
machine hanger. Uh, let's get you out of the way. I wonder if I can, like, put you on something and then activate you. Alright, well, it doesn't look like there's anything back over here in this scary dark corner. I am the danger. Zonalar, I was a normal human guy. And I, I went to... Wow, look at that. That's cool. I went to the doctor to get a brain scan. And my brain got scanned and then I woke up here. So there's like some sort of tech, biotech stuff like growing out of of technology. Infecting other technologies. So AR95, A95 worker V3. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Whoa, uh, oh, uh, whoa, uh, whoa. Whoa. Whoa, shit. Oh, fuck. No. Okay. It's okay, Simon. We're gonna be cool. We're gonna be cool. We're gonna be cool. It's okay. And I know there's like some shit here. It's okay. We're gonna be cool. Uh, I don't like looking at those things. Those things freak me out. They remind me too much of myself. Ha! Ah. Hmm. I can crouch. What's around here? Oh, there's more of the things. Oh my god. Ah, that's pretty weird, man. I like it. I like this kind of weird. This is my kind of weird. Oh yeah, let's do it! Click the thing! Hey you. Can you talk? Can you talk like the others? Yeah. Oh my god, no. They shut him down. They didn't even think about it. Creepy sounds around corners. I don't like that. Wait a minute, there were two. Now there's only one. Oh my god, the machines are coming alive. Look at that. You busted open the thing. Let's go back and look at the... Break room thermal plant. What's this? So, like, there are different experiences of fear, right? DMFTW said in, in chat, DMFTW123 said, for some reason I'm not afraid of this game. I'm not scared of this game. And, like, I'm not scared of it either. I'm not I'm not sitting here like, Ugh, scared, ah, you know, oh shit, screaming. But there is a general aura of creepiness, and I love it. It's just a little bit unsettling. Um, and that's also awesome. And I love it. Look, he's like a little dude. What's up, little dude? I wish I could stick you on a wall and then activate you. Attention. Stand clear. Okay, so, like... Man, I feel like there's gotta be a multi-tool somewhere. There's a thing in the very first room. It's like, hey, multi-tool, and now I've been all around, and there's no multi-tool anywhere. I'm very disappointed about that.
Zenolar says it's perfectly. Uh, I am unsettled by this game, and I want to explore it more. That is absolutely true. That's the deal, man. I'm unsettled by this game, and I want to explore it more. I want to find out what this game is trying to say. Boop, 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 boop. It's a comb. Dropping the comb. Yeah, there's nothing. There's nothing here. Time to follow that freaky monster that busts down that door. Let's go. Okay. Omni time. Dude, but he doesn't look like he's all dinosaurified. Some Korean lettering? Oh, let's go look like right through this. Yeah, what am I gonna see? Ah, oh, Frictional Games didn't show me anything. I'm disappointed, Frictional. So these little tendrils, they're strong, huh? Stronger than doors. Ooh. Service station storage and robot dock. Robot dock. Hey, little guy. Are you friendly? You look friendly. Ah, look. I can come back in this little tiny space. Haimatsu. It's an interesting little logo there. It looks kind of growth-like, right? Whoa, shit! No! I don't like it. Oh, no. I'm going to get noticed. There's a chance of being noticed by a thing. I don't want that. God, I like how they used a tooltip to, to make it seem more scary. It's so good. Frictional games. Ah, oh, so good at what they do. Okay, I really want to... I really want to like turn on the lights and shit. I also have no idea what I'm hearing. Whoa! Fuck! No! Oh my god! Oh, I'm just gonna like hide back here. It's fine. We're cool. Okay, that was that's scary. Now I'm going to open the door. Cool. Boop. Whoa. Who would ever do that in real life? Who would ever? Video games. Can you imagine if this was a VR program? An Oculus Rift game? Oh, that would be so fucking freaky. Ooh, an Omnitool! Omnitool V2.5 Smart Access Computer by Haimatsu Technologies. The Omnitool is an advanced interface for accessing, managing, and controlling computerized systems. The onboard intelligence includes an open set of behaviors and protocols to enable, to enable the user to automate routine actions through basic logical charts. Over time, the Omnitool will automatically adapt its programs to cover subconscious behavior to optimize work and minimize user error. That doesn't sound like a bad sort of thing at all, Haimatsu. The Omnitool has a short-range signal useful for basic or automated actions, such as opening doors. While performing complex operations, the Omnitool should be physically connected to a workstation or terminal. 
To upgrade your device, simply slide operators into the main or the auxiliary slot. The main slot has a standard C11-21 connector, which allows the user to fit most market Cortex chips onto the Omnitool. Notice that introducing an additional AI will override the onboard intelligence. The auxiliary slot is a multi-connector fitting a large range of tool chip models including, but not limited to, AI-113-398B, A2-090-101X, HAITT-1-9, and JU-CI-3229. This has been Haimatsu Corporation telling you about your Omnitool. Hmm. Tab to see your inventory. I cannot do that. Oh, cool. I only have one item in my inventory. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Omni tool. Close. Stay closed. Okay, nothing. So yeah, this Omni tool is like an adaptive, smart tool. Interfaces with computer programs. Oh shit, no! Look, oh my god! They killed him! Ah! I make fun of it, but I love it. One of the reasons that I like Frictional Games stuff so much is that they do excellent environmental storytelling. And it's not all in your face, right? Glasses underscore is asking, will I ever continue my Unity, my learning Unity videos? Um, which, maybe? Um, I've enjoyed doing those, but uh, honestly, I just don't have a schedule that I keep myself to. And that's the biggest problem for me in streaming, is not having a schedule and not keeping to it. So, yeah, I want to use that Omni tool. Let's go. No, got to go back to the thing. Not getting noticed. I'm probably going to get noticed. Senpai is going to notice me. What's up? Omni tool. Go. Nope. That's locked. Can I, like, connect my only tool to this shit? Look through the thing again. I should put make a schedule onto my schedule. Yep. I should. Oh no. Oh my god. What was that? I don't know. I should go right there. Add it to my fitness schedule, which I have been crushing. I have. I did good this week. I'm proud of that. Okay, so I do have to go this way. But what? Where did that light come from? Was it... Oh, shit. Something broke down the door. Let's go do Omnitool stuff. Yeah, slot it. Let's go. AI Helper Jane. Pathos 2 reading. Scanning the Omni tool. Service console up to 3, including pilot seat activated. Including pilot seat system status. Remote access denied. Servers offline. Main power suspended. Well, that's some bullshit. Emergency systems, 13 days remaining. Fuck. 3 progress. Scan SJ. Ooh. I think I just put... Oh, what? Whoa. Whoa. What? Ah, that's some freaky shit here. Theta Cash Grass Legacy Unfold. Sub Simon Jarrett. That's me. Ot David Munchie. That's the Doctor 2015 V1. What? Toronto. Operation unavailable. Oh, my God. Whoa.
Welcome back, Louise Muron. Oops, along. Your Omni tool is in perfect condition, but not fitted with a tool chip. Note that without a tool chip, your FST kit will be unavailable, including your cross site security access. So, Louise Muron was the person who got murdered by the wall. That sucks. I'm sorry, Louise Muron. Well, your Omni tool will be put to good use. Unlock toolbox. Done. Orientation. Ooh, boy. What? Don't get me wrong. I don't want to get in your way. We need you guys to keep this place up and running. But there needs to be at least some level of security oh, on this Field things. service technician. I don't want to hear you barge into some quarantined area at Omicron and just knock down the whole place with some virus or whatever the hell they're doing over there. This is what you can do. You'll be able to use it to open doors. Basically all of them. If you can't, there's something wrong or someone didn't want you in there. Then what do you do? You shove that on the tool into a terminal and see if you can't get around it somehow. I mean, sometimes you'll need to get into places where you don't belong. Cool. Just find a way. You're an engineer for crying out loud. God, what a good orientation. What else? Take care of your gear. Don't be an asshole. That's about it, really. My name is John Strohmeyer, Pathos 2 security operative. I got an office at Data. Come see me if you got any issues you can't handle yourself. Theta. So there's a bunch of different sites. And they're all named after... After things. And uh, maybe I'm at Gamma? Is that what that means, I wonder? Huh. Well. Uh, okay, well I unlocked the tool, whatever. So, yeah. Let's just do that. Yeah, so what do I got? I got like a bunch of things. Chink. Tool chip found. Slurp. Cool. Are these all tool chips? Oh, I see. Okay, so now I can go back and I can do the thing. So that's weird. Yep, yep, yep. Operation unavailable. APPS. Hmm. So, manage toolchip. Welcome back, Louise Muron. Your Omni tool is in perfect condition and fitted with a toolchip. Run an update to confirm the FST kit installation and the latest security ciphers. Let's do it. Security cipher updated. Cool. Please remove the Omni tool. It's done. My Omni tool is the best. Now I can go do things. Pilot seat number three, Upsilon, in progress. Ooh, look at that shit. What is going on? Something dead. Oh my god. Wow. Power. Whoa. Was that across my whole vision? No. Interesting. Construct network. Oops, on offline. Oh, interesting. Pilot status. No pilot found. Sync pilot black box. Connection status. Huh. Reports. Pilot Carl Semkin support Amy Azaro vehicle tugger. Task replaced heat shields on southern flu. Result success. Hey, great. Semkin reported uncharacteristic levels of nausea after the mission. Diagnostics show a spike of electromagnetism surrounding the pilot helmet, which is believed to be the cause of Semkin's systems. No indication of what created this anomaly. How on earth would they test for that? Like, why would they be like, oh, you're nauseous. Let's test the electromagnetic output around your helmet. Strange. What's this? Nothing. Attention! The pilot system has become increasingly unreliable. Everyone who's been using it the last couple of months has been having headaches and spells of nausea. Last week, Gavin was knocked out for 30 hours when trying to direct a helper cluster. This is not acceptable. We will figure this out, but for the time being, I'm shutting down the usage of the pilot system. This means you'll have to do some more heavy lifting, performing the operations through programming or physical labor. No one is happy about this, so don't bother complaining. Jane Adams, Chief Factor. I'm definitely at the Gamma Lab. Interesting. Okay, so there's some like piloting bullshit that happens around here. Can I 
do this thing again? No? Oh, interesting. Whatever. All right. Well, when you've been everywhere that you can go and then a new place has been broken through by a demonic robot, you go to the place that's been broken through by the demonic robot. Let's go. How's everybody doing today? Are you all, like, uh, excited about TwitchCon, not following TwitchCon, bummed that your favorite streamers are offline? Oh. Oh, my God. I haven't played System of Shock 2 Belzer Goose. I've played Bioshock and Bioshock Infinite. Ooh, yeah. Oh, man. Cool, exciting stuff. Oh, my God. Look at that. Oh, cool. Everybody's bummed about TwitchCon because their favorite streamers are not online. Well, I'm glad you're here, friends. Just so y'all know, probably in another 15 minutes, I'm going to hop offline, but I will host the uh, H1Z1 Invitational stream. This chat will remain active, and I'll probably be spamming chat with my It Me JP fails, along with the best of them. I'm excited to watch my favorite streamers duke it out on the fields of glorious combat. But until then... Let's get freaky. Can I touch it? Oh shit! <laughs> I can't touch it. <laughs> ah, I love it. That's so good. Oh man. <laughs> I'm such a dork. Yeah, I heard Connor Wu asked a question on drop, drop frames. And and DJ we didn't recognize him, that's that's great. Oh, see you Lauren. Thanks for hanging out for a while. Hope you have a good time with your friend. Oh, check it out, I'm on the other side. I'm on the other side. I love it when levels take you back through spaces you've been before but you couldn't get to. Ah, oh, so good. That's good level design, y'all. Okay, so I came through here already. something change over here? I don't think so. Nope, nope, nope. This is where I got the Omni tool from. J JP didn't catch it, so we came out of the back to yell at JP. Awesome. JP has so much on his mind, though. Like, that, that doesn't surprise me. That guy. That guy's got a lot going on. Lin Lin 98 will I be streaming after the H1Z1 Invitationals? Uh, yeah, probably so. You know, I'm really enjoying this game. So I will probably pick it up after the uh, Invitationals are over. Uh, Natali Connor Wu is a character from a show that I'm a part of on JP's channel called Swan Song. It's a role-playing game where we play... We play uh, space people in the year 3200 or something along those lines. Let's swipe it! Access granted. A lot of irons in the fire. That's a great way to describe JP. A lot of irons in the fire. Oh shit, look! Oh my god! It's Bioshock! I'm getting some messages on Twitch, so if you're, not Twitch, but on Steam, so if you're hearing little blips, that's from me. This is a, fr a friend of mine saying that he's loving Diablos. Uh, let me let me see for a second if I do that. Does it all come up? No, it doesn't. I just let him know I was streaming. Let's see if I can like turn off notifications or something. Uh, view all friends. Busy? There we go. Maybe that works. Who knows? Okay, so this is Bioshock. Good. 
Ooh, check it out. Oh, a freaky. Oh shit, look, it's a sh it's a shark that's been infected by the tentacle bullshit. Oh, it's some sort of deep chasm. What are those? What are those? Yeah. I'm loving it. Freaky techno bio infectious stuff. Data buffer available. Let's view the data buffer. Shut that shit down. Let's get the fuck out of here and leave that guy behind. Who knows who he is? Someone was like, you can check the back. Oh, shit. Like nothing happened. Everything still looks the same. All silence alike. Whoa, multiple eyes on that chick's face. What is that? What's that a drawing of? It looks like a little sketch of some uh, space or something like that. A little architectural drawing. Back and different. Thick structure gel they can't shake. Wow's freaky fishes. Something about structure gel. Like that, that sentient machine wanted structure gel. Invitational's in like five minutes, yo. No worries, y'all. We'll make sure. We'll make sure you catch it. Thermal plant, break room, machine hangar, service station, storage. Okay, so what's this way? Observation tower and Securita. I don't think anybody's got to help anybody. Uh, oh, shit. No, fuck. What's that? Oh, yeah, no, totally. Do it! Come on, buddy! Yep, just, ah. yeah. What was that? What? You didn't even put your finger in there? Ah. It doesn't hurt anymore. Yeah, good. Cool. Good. I feel better. That was, that was a good thing to do. That was definitely not bad. Awesome. Yeah, so uh, I'm going to save. I think that's a great like place to stop. Like That was fucking freaky. I loved it. Like some sort of like pulsating machine, bio-machine anus that, that also like interfaced with my brain somehow. Great. Awesome. Um, yeah, so I'm going to like save and exit, and uh, I'll get ready to host the Invitational. I'm going to hang out here just for like another five or ten minutes or whatever. Um, and then we'll go ahead with the host. So, uh, yeah. Like, do you got, do you got any, um, you guys have any questions for me today here on stream? <laughs> Ragged Ron says, my reaction to the orifices has been very different to the other streamers he's watched play this. I hope that's a good thing. Uh, learning Unity is going slow. Like, you know, I don't, I don't do a lot of it off stream, actually. But I should. I should do some more. That invitational stream should start within another 5-10 minutes here, urging to pee. The solid gank, I do love you. I do love you all. Here, look at a cute kitty. Everybody look. 
Look at this cutie. Oh, she wants belly rubs. Let's do it. Let's give the belly rubs to the kitty. Uh, Falask is asking if I create creatures for the West Marches, which is the Dungeons and Dragons show that I run, by the way. If you Google West Marches, you'll find it. Um, and the answer is, usually I use pre-established stats from the rulebook, but I flavor the creatures very differently. Um, Bald Chansey, I'm working out at home. Um, there is a gym at my apartment complex, that's where I use the rowing machine, but mostly it's just body weight stuff, and I have a couple of, uh, barbells that I use for, like, weighted split leg squats. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna host the stream so that, uh, so that we don't have terrible cancer chat. Let's see, I'm gonna swap over to the full stream, full screen. Boop. My beautiful face, full stream. Let's see, I'm gonna save save and exit. That's all I'm doing in the background here. Oh, I can't save and exit. Oh, huh. Well, dang, I let me let me get to a point where I can save and exit and then save and exit. Boop. Boop. Hi, Red Eye 92. Can I save and exit now? No. Maybe it's because it just auto-saved or something? Yeah, now I can save an exit. There we go. Cool. Done. My stash is a little bit out of control. I actually need to... I need to trim all this. It's it's too wild right now. Now I'll go full screen. Yeah. Hmm. Stash. So, I'm going to hop out of the game here. Cool. I'm having a lot of fun. A lot of fun with Soma so far. Offensively handsome. Um, Sauglas is asking, am I going to use elemental evil spells and races in the West Marches? Um, and I think not. Because the feel for the elemental evil stuff is really different from like the West Marchian feel that I'm going for, so what's going on here? This side of my mustache is all like curled down. No good. Hmm. When are we getting a musical R and D so you can hear me sing? I don't know. Go out into the wilderness and fight bears with my manly beard. I'm gonna hop over to the Twitch stream and see if it's starting to fire up. Twitch dot tv slash twitch we don't have any other um, shows queued up for R&D yet okay so we got some 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 casters talking from daybreak games sitting here at a at a table so i'm going to go ahead and start the host so that uh, we can all hang out in my chat here together and watch this. So uh, thank you all for coming out to my stream today. Um, you know what? Keep an eye out on my Twitter because I think it's pretty likely that once the H1Z1 Invitational is over, I'm going to go back to Soma. I had a great time playing that just now. So like, yeah, double thumbs up. We're going to keep doing it. Keep that eye out. Uh, also, feel free to hit that follow button down there if you're not following me already. And then you'll, you know, get notifications if you choose about when I go live or be able to see me live on Twitch. So, be awesome. Stay awesome. Let's watch some great stuff. Slash host Twitch. <laughs> 